Hey everybody, welcome to another Rock for Q video and it's been a long time but here we are with another My Lineup journey this time, well I say this time, still on the 5 Reds lineup and this one I get a new high break but don't really make progress other than that. Um, so yeah, so this isn't, I've only got two, um, two attempts to show you, this one because it's the first attempt and it just it was a natural beginning to the video and then the second attempt or not the second attempt but the second attempt i'm going to show you is the one where i get the high break bit of warning first though uh my table camera runs out of storage space so i don't have the table camera for the second attempt so it's all from the head cam so if you get a bit of motion sickness maybe uh skip this video but uh, yeah so a new high break so let's uh watch this uh, sort of warm-up session so I can give you a reminder about the uh, routine. So this is basically my uh, journey to becoming capable of doing a full uh, 15 red lineup. And what I'm doing is starting off with a five red lineup. And then once I've cleared this one, I'm going to add two reds to it. And I'm going to keep going until I get to a 15 red lineup. And uh, yeah, so I've been doing this one for probably about three months now, but to be honest, I don't think, I don't think I've done it for a couple of months, uh, but I thought this evening I'd give it a go while I was down in the club, uh, see if I'd made any progress. And uh, yeah, lo and behold, I got a new high break, but I still haven't managed to clear it. So here we go, When this is the actual attempt. So as I say, no table camera, just the head cam. I've hidden the scoreboard when uh, I'm down on the shop, just because it's uh, a bit of a distraction. So yeah, I've got 21 to beat. I don't beat it by much, but I do beat it by at least more than one anyway. So just about enough angle on this pink to run through for one of the two reds above the black. Just about get that pink in. I also need to remember to stay down on the shot more. In my defense, I thought the table camera was working, so uh, I didn't think I'd have to worry about it too much. <sighs> but never mind. Uh, pink, the, pink did go in though, trust me. Uh, and I've got a fairly decent, yeah, fairly decent um, angle on this red to just screw back for the black. I just don't quite get into it enough. Uh, I'm okay, but having to get the rest out. I've just speeded this up a bit because I'm sort of looking at the uh, shot. Uh, having to get the rest out. So this is a bit tricky. Uh, and again, I stand up far too quick on the shot, but trust me when I say it goes in. And we continue just putting the black on. I'm just putting my score on the scoreboard because that's the um, best I've done in this session so far. So I only put the score on the scoreboard if it's the best I've done for the session. So again, another nice angle on this red to come out for the pink. Uh, there we go. So I should now be able to... I've either got the pink or the black. I think I've probably take the black, actually. Uh, I think the pink is a bit straight, so I will probably take this black. Yep. So a nice angle on this black to get out, but I don't put enough top spin on it, so it just cannons, <coughs> excuse me, cannons into the pink, which just makes things a little more tricky. Uh, but that cannon might be useful. Uh, the cue ball was going a bit fast, so it might have gone all up the table. And now left with this tough long red into the far corner. So there we have it, that's the new high break of 24. And I do have a shot with the rest on this pink, but uh, it doesn't go well. Kind of miss Q, a uh, bit of overstretching, and uh, yeah, it wasn't great. It's a shame though, because I did get a reasonable position on the red. Anyway, that is it for this video. As I say, not much progress, but some. Really hope I clear this routine soon because I really like to move on to a seven red lineup, but I'm not going to jump the gun. Anyway, see you next time. Thank you.